Okay, so you have a bunch of raw data that you need to make useful. But wrangling that data can be challenging, requiring expertise, computational resources, and a lot of work to set up. To take that burden off the data scientists, businesses are now using a tool called a feature store to help them not only store their data, but also transform it into useful features that machine learning models can use directly to make predictions that solve problems. That raw data is typically coming from various data sources of various types, structured, unstructured, streaming, batch, real-time. It all needs to get pulled and stored somewhere. That somewhere can be a feature store. And the feature store then takes that raw data and makes it available for consumption. And in some implementations, provides feature pipelines that can transform that data. The pipelines produce process features that can be used for both online and offline environments. Those process features are then used by data scientists and ML engineers to produce high quality predictive models. The outputs of those models then get used to solve a plethora of business problems for end users. Feature stores allow data scientists to work more efficiently by allowing the reuse and sharing of features so that other teams can use them too and thereby increase their own productivity since they don't have to do it from scratch. This helps make the most out of the data and makes things better for data scientists by providing solutions to common data engineering problems. Feature stores can also provide data governance through feature lineage and versioning. Those with monitoring capabilities allow the business to track the distribution of their features over time and discover problems such as training serving SKU or concept drift. Overall, a feature store functions as a powerful interface between your data and your models and is a powerful tool within the MLOps stack.